Five years ago, I came in the Alps, an experience so unforgettable that I promised myself I would one day return. Now, after years of waiting, I have finally taken the plunge. Only this time, I'm exploring the Dolomites, the Alps' stunning neighbor. My journey begins in Hamburg, the northern port city I now call home, nestled along the mouth of the Elbe. From here, I embark on a nine-hour ride, traveling across Germany, towards the south. Eventually, I arrive in Munich, the vibrant Bavarian metropolis known as the Gateway to the Dolomites. As beautiful as Munich was, I couldn't linger. The mountains were calling and my adventure was just the beginning. My adventure begins in Toblach, a charming town nestled in the mountains of South Tyrol. I stayed the night at a lovely hostel, where the foods are adequate, but the beds are soft. From there, I hop on a bus that wound its way through the picturesque valley taking me to the start of the hike at Refugio Aronzo, an hour away. As the bus journeyed deeper into the Dolomites, towering peaks surrounded me on all sides, their jagged silhouette filling the horizon. The anticipation grew with each passing moment, knowing that soon my feet would be tracing their rugged path. My first hike took me to the Cadini di Misurina viewpoint, a stunning but challenging two-hour trek. Though the beauty of the trail was undeniable, it wasn't to be taken lightly, as the path hugged narrow ledges with steep cliffs just a step away. One wrong move could mean a dangerous fall. The reward was well worth the effort. Halfway of the Trecime, um, circuit track. So this is like a, this is the Trecime. So this is a, like a perfect um, photo spot um, to actually capture 
like the the view and also like this this, um, this mountain back here also like it's quite nice and On the next day, we returned to Toblach to prepare for the next leg of the adventure. From there, I boarded the bus and headed west towards the finest Sennes Brace Natural Park, eager for the next chapter of the journey. So today, uh, we are exploring Lago di Brace. Um, there's not much to see here except for the lake itself. There is a small circuit track around the lake, so probably I'm going to do that. And it's a very short track, um, so let's get to it. The surrounding views on the track were worth every step. The sun shining on the glimmering blue waters was truly a sight to behold. An experience you have to see for yourself to fully appreciate. Um, we are from Moran and it will be our last hike for this trip and I'm really looking forward to it and I really hope the weather stays the same and we'll have like really sunny weather on top when we reach the the peaks and we could actually get some good shots so yeah that's it for today's update
towards the end of it and goodbye and probably see you next time ciao